Hey guys, it's Ty here with the Presser Pups. This is their one month update. They are looking good. Still feeding on mom. <clears throat> There's Offset. Uh oh, I'm messing up his feeding. Anyway, I just wanted to give y'all an update. Hey, hey, mulatto. It's all set, guys. He is up and a fatty. While I update you guys, I'm all set. Oh, look at him set. Let him see you, boy. Yes, indeed. He's looking great. Oh. There he is, offset fans. Just a growing. I'm so proud of what he looks like right now. His attitude is awesome. Full of energy. He just got done feeding on his mom. But he's waking up. I gotta check him out for a minute. He's gonna weigh him up. What's up, Seth? Hey, hey, man. Hey, man. Look at him. Look at him. Yeah. Hey. Hey, big guy. Hey, big guy. Hey. Look at this sister trying to come close. Yeah. Hey. Hey, puppy. Hey. Ouch. <laughs> Those teeth were working. I actually just started them on uh, soft food as well. Tried it out. He tore it up. I'll present one of those videos. Show you guys what he got going on in that area. I mean, he is a big. <laughs> All set in brownie. Yeah. That's a boy. Hi. 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 I don't know if y'all noticed, but I took the uh, styrofoam from around the uh, whelping box at this point. They are uh, gnawing on everything. Look at that pup there, biting down that big old bone. Yeah, so I didn't want to take any chances. So I recommend once your puppies begin to have teeth, start really biting down on things, remove the styrofoam. Cause I actually found like a mouth full on Brownie or in Brownie's mouth, actually. And then as I talk about it, there he is chewing on things. And some may ask why do I have the uh, green grass carpet in there along with the uh, red cedar chips? Well, when I had the uh, sheet in there to absorb some of the uh, urine and feces. Uh, I noticed that the puppies were just kind of crawling in it and it just didn't seem sanitary at the end of the day. Uh, the red cedar holds down the smell um, and uh, it allows them to get a better grip as they began to start walking and things like that. Taking their first steps, I noticed. So I changed it out so that they could have a better grip up under their paws. There you go. So that's why I did that as well. So 
I hope those tips were helpful. Looking brownie. She right up under me. That's a girl. That's a good girl. That's a good girl. That's a good girl. Yeah. Testing their skills. See, they can see. They can hear. That's awesome. Look at them. Look at them from the back. Oh, my goodness. Look at them. That's the other thing, guys. They were also using the phone <laughs> and climbing out a lot easier. We may be able to catch them. He's going to start whining in a minute. He wants to get out and play. He wants to get out and play. I ain't set. We're going to get you weighed up. Then we're going to get you out of here. Let you play a little bit. Look at him. He don't care. Something up. Shake that thing, set. Shake it. Shake it, boy. Shake it. Picture perfect kennels. We got those pressers. Shake it. Shake it. Yeah, shake that thing, set. Okay, guys, so I'm going to go ahead and step on the scale and see what I weigh up. And uh, then we'll get I'm right at 207 today. All right. Let's see if I can get him off his sister. I'm toughening her up. I guess she really need any help, but she don't play. So, but uh, I'm gonna get him and uh, see what he weighs up. I'm right at 207 even. Okay, guys, so I offset down here. I'm gonna pick him up, being that I'm doing this by myself today. And we're gonna see what the numbers are. All right, 218. I see that. 218. Uh, offset. So if I was 207 and it's 218, that means you're about 11 pounds. That's 11 pound boy right there. That thing is heavy. Woo. Look at him. Picture perfect. All right. Go down there and do your thing. All right, guys. So, I appreciate y'all hanging out with us. Checking Offset out. And his sisters. This is their one month update. They're actually one month old. Today is February 6th. Born January 6th. The day the uh, Capitol actually was stormed. That tripped me out when I um played that back in my head. I was like, wow, January 6th, January 6th. Wow, special pups right here, I tell you. Anyway, thanks for uh, stopping by, liking, and subscribing. And um, as always, man, uh, share the videos, man. You know someone that's interested in a presser puppy or pressers, period. This will give them an uh, indication as to what the pups will look, come out looking like, how they're going to act, and things like that. And um. I have you guys follow Offset's life in its entirety. So, any Offset's fans out there, we appreciate you chiming in, leaving comments, letting us know what you think about him and his growth process and things of that nature. The process of uh, the kennel, Picture Perfect Kennels. We appreciate you. Uh-uh. 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 Okay. Okay. Before I get out of here, I guess I'll give y'all a little bit more.
You hear Mulatto outside? She's ready to come in. She's been a great mom. Mulatto fans, she's been a great mom to the pups. Oh, one other thing. These uh, cedar red chips, yeah, a mess. Y'all see what I gotta deal with? I gotta clean this out dang near every day. But um, at the end of the day, it's worth it, man. It's for the pups, right? Anything for the pup pups. Look at them. I can't take the camera off them. Picture perfect. 